I think a lot of the time people expect less of me or don't expect me to be intelligent or capable in a lot of situations. The Division of Equity and Inclusion reports that since the passage of Prop 209 in 1996, the number of black students at UC Berkeley is dwindling. Black and African American students make up 3.1% of campus, some of the lowest in the state. I definitely did not expect that enrollment to be as low as it is. And I think that's something that blindsides a lot of students and also keeps a lot of black students from coming to Cal, which is disappointing. Even when offered admission, black students opt not to enroll, noting that Berkeley is unwelcoming. Some say that it is not a place for black students to thrive. I like to take time to like validate myself and remind myself that there's a reason why I'm here in the first place. And also just sharing experiences with other people. It's nice to know that I'm not alone. ASUC Senator Sarkadia Du says she and other senators are working with the chancellor to make Berkeley more diverse. I think we should be more diverse in our undergraduate student body, our graduate student body, our faculty and our staff. So that will be a really important priority for me. Seeing some tangible items there, which is good because for a long time we haven't. We're seeing things like um, the Chancellor's Diversity Project. We're seeing things like um, the school's commitment to becoming a Hispanic serving institution in 10 years. While some change has happened, there is still a lot more to be done. There's a lot of buzzwords that get thrown out and not necessarily as much action and tangible support as I personally would like to see. So I think we all have to be holding our administrators accountable. With debate reignited over the merits of Prop 209, the face of diversity on campus has yet to be seen. Laylee Ipsa for CalTV News.